yellow. So what to do with a card that you don't know nothing about? Um, that's 550. Pretty old thing. Um, yeah, so again. Video was sponsored by Arcadia Express in Guernsey. Thank you very much. So what I have is a, is a very good card. Um, that unfortunately, ta -da, this happened and also this happened to it. That's not good. Uh, not only aesthetically, we have one good fan. Uh, but also vibrations and not as good as cooling and also it's pretty loud probably I never even turn it on yet but I've measured it and it's fine so how do we approach a card like that so first of all uh, we do not connect that to our PC no why because it can cause fire burn your house down and curse your family to the fourth generation. So, uh, what we want is to check these pins, like card is facing us here, right? That's the top of the card. So, we need to check these pins. The first three from the left, of course, uh, those are 12 volt. And uh, the fourth one from the right is there's one missing by the way, uh, and more missing because they're not needed here. Fourth one from the right is 3.3 volt, and the next one to it is ground. So you measure that, you take your multimeter and measure them for shorts. Uh, that's one thing. Secondly, uh, when done with that, uh, any PCIe 12 volt connectors also must be checked one row is 12 volts one row is ground uh, there are exceptions uh, some grounds uh, may not be connected like the on the six pin one um, the middle ground cannot be connected because it's not needed in the specification although most cards does have it soldered on uh, just because and there is also a voltage voltage sensing pin but we don't care about it now. For now, we want to know if the sh any shorts are there between the 12 volt pin and the ground pins. So that's where you start. As by magic, nothing happened. Uh, but we have a voltage meter here. Sorry, it's a potato one, B and Q, see? Uh, it's all I have, unfortunately. Ah, uh, it's good enough for such such things. So one probe to ground. The bracket is in the ground. Right? There's not like a lacquer or something on it. So the, now next probe, right? Where is my probe? Can't see. Uh, so there is my probe. So we go. Twelve volt. There was a beep, but this is fine. It stopped immediately. Capacitor charged, and that's it. No short. Yeah, it's fine. That's it. That's a uh, resistance. So now let's measure three point three. Oh, sorry, there is three point three, and. Nothing. That's drop. Uh, it's fine. And the next pin is ground, see? So if I go to the ground pin, beeps, short, ground to ground, which is, which is, of course, okay. So no short here, no short here. We golden. Now, I should record how to do that but i can't i don't have three hands unfortunately uh, so you need to trust me i've measured it uh, and yeah and it seems to be all right also so if that's all right 
Uh, is it okay to connect it to your PC? Um, well, the chances that it will blow up are just... Well, they're good at this point. Because uh, definitely there is no short directly to your, to the, to your computer. So that's alright. Uh, it's still not enough to know if the cart is good, of course. We need to take it apart. Uh, but the first check, the check that you always can do without even touching a screwdriver, was that. Okay, so the magic is I can probably probe that. See? You can't see. That's just stupid. No beeps. No beeps. It's fine. Um, I was taking it apart because I'm after the fan for the other graphic card and I spotted this. This is a original warranty sticker and it says it's 2GB version so it's the fancy one. Um, I don't know what type of memory that is. We'll see later. Uh, but then this signs in ancient tongue. I don't know what that means. Probably means something to someone. Uh, all right, let's continue then. And this is how it looks like completely naked. <gasps> Pornographic. There is magic, of course. Magic. Um, what shall we do now? Um, nothing, I, I guess. Um, I'm after the fan, so we will continue on it. Maybe uh, some other day. Uh, typical layout. Typical card. Worthless these days. Everyone sees 50 Ti, runs away, even if it's 1080, 1050 Ti, it's 550 Ti. So, yeah, it's basically e-waste.